Hi, it's Lonnie with Crafty Traveler at the Homestead. And this video is my little short video of my sew day while at Lake Kauia Campground. show you my outdoor sewing setup and the views of the beautiful lake that I had while sewing on a project. Here's the project I was working on. Besides all the instructions, it came with pre-marked batting and then I had the fabric. Here's the video to show you my sewing setup outside my camp and the beautiful scenery. Here's my little sewing station in front of the trailer, plugged into the trailer, and it's shady right now, and if it gets sunny, I'll put the awning on. Here's my view from my sewing station looking out to the lake. I forgot to pack my rotary cutter. So I'll be using my scissors to cut the strips. Well, since I forgot my rotary cutter, I'm measuring this. So it needs to be one and a half. I'm using a pencil line, and I'm going to cut it with my scissors. This one's got to be two and a half inches. I need to cut four, two and a half by nine. You can see the batting has markings in it. I've cut all my pieces that'll fit. So this is right sides together with the bottom one, and I'm stitching that, and it's a stitch as you go kind of pattern for this bag. And I'm still outside. As I stitch, Snickers is here being very good, laying on his little camper rug in front of the door. Now I have finished stitching all the strips down. Now I have to attach the bottom, top, and the sides and then fold it in half and sew up the side seams. Got as far as I can go today. I just have to put the straps on it. There it is. Back. I hope you liked the video. It's a little short, but I think you get the idea of how I sew outside scenery I saw. Here is the finished product. Here's the finished product with the handle. I did finish the handles after I got home. Stay crafty when doing a sew day at your campsite. as always, give me a thumbs up, comment, share, and subscribe. Stay crafty.